hey what's up guys so you have taken once again so in this video i'll be showing you how to transfer app from one console account to another so now um that is one of my app on play store which i want to say for someone so um in this video i'll be showing you how you can transfer app from one console account to another console account so now um you log into your console account All right, so you can see this is my console account here. You can see. So this is the app I want to transfer. This is the app I want to transfer to someone else's console account. So for us to do this, you you have to you need a lot of things for you to transfer your app. You need your transaction ID, your account ID, and all this stuff. You need all this stuff in order for you to transfer app. So what you're going to do is just come here, come to app transfer. On the app transfer, um, you can see your transfer request. Um, apps that you have, like you can see it here. Apps that you transfer to another developer can't be shown here. So if you want to transfer app, click on transfer app. Once you click on transfer app, they will request for your transaction ID. Transaction ID is the ID of developer account eh, from which the app have been transferred. So to find your ID, transaction ID, search the original owner of the email, blah, blah. So for you to get your transaction ID, because I'm sending this stuff now. So if I want to get my transaction ID, I have to go to my, to my Google, go to my payments, other payments, go to uh, manage purchases. Uh, sorry, not here. I'll come down to your coin payments for subscription now. You can come to payment method. Under payment method, go to activity. So under activity, you will see all what you have purchased. These are things I've purchased on, on my Google. So this is the Google console account. So you come down and copy your transaction ID here. You can see this transaction ID here. So that's what they requested for. So your transaction ID. So I'm pasting it here. So now the next thing is new developer account. The account I want to transfer the app to. The developer account to, to which the app will be transferred to. So I put the developer details here. So for me to put the developer details, I've already collected the details. So this is the um, what they requested for is developer account. So developer ID or a package or app package name. So developer ID or app package name. So for already save it here. This is developer ID. This is developer ID. You can find. So this is it. That is developer ID and new account transaction id transaction id of the developer so it's also here as well done so paste and reason for transfer so reason for transfer you can see they say selling apps owned by this account loan apps as part of commercial agreement transferring app to to business organization or reorganization need to change the primary email address or console account or contact details for this account issue with profile uh, payment profile and other things so just click on selling apps by by this account so click on relationship they ask for relationship that owned by some legal entity owned by parents the same parent company your account is owned by sub a uh, subsidiary and the account is owned by so you can just choose anything else but i'm clicking on none of the above so once i'm done with all this so now the next thing is to choose the app you want to transfer is to choose the app you want to transfer here yeah, i'm gonna choose the app you want to transfer which is this this is the app i want to transfer click on apply once you click on apply you can see everything is on here and you click on review and transfer so under review and transfer you scroll down you click on agree 
So you can see their all their terms and condition. Yeah, you can accept the terms and condition. Transferring this app means that you will no longer be able to manage them in in play console by transferring your blah blah blah. You will lose the financial report, any estimated everything. You will lose other if you are sending anything, you will lose everything about the app. If you are transferring the app, you no longer be able to manage the star every everything about the app. So you can sell it. You can see. And we are good to go. So next thing is click on agree and transfer. Uh, you can see uh, i showing that this app has error not that, not that the app has error the app doesn't have any error so what the issue here is um you can see that the master saver link a payment merchant accounts like um the new developer account that i want to send this account uh, this app to have to link uh, that they are, the new developer is not linked to a google payments merchants um center account so ask the account owner to to link the account from financial page reports in play console so now the owner have to link it and once the owner successfully link the account automatically i can just click on review and transfer and once i click on review and transfer and agree as once i click on agree and transfer it will take like one to three days that's 24 hours max 24 hours minimum to to 48 hours and the person um gets the account the app and you're good to go so that's it so if you have any question or you are facing any issue after this you can let me know drop it on the comment section so bye guys